Welcome everyone. If we want to download macro molecule, we go to the RCSP website and search for the macro molecule and download the PDB. Sometimes we need to search very extensively to get the best resolution PDB. There may be number of PDB IDs available for same macro molecule. To find PDB ID with the best resolution, there is an alternate way. If we search for cyclooxygenase, there are many results available. There may be number of PDB available for the same macro molecule. To find the PDB ID with the best resolution, there is an alternate way. First we go to the Uniprot database. Uniprot.org Next we go to the advanced search and we using the filters we need cyclooxygenase enzyme okay so in first filter we enter the cyclooxygenase next filter we are going to add organism name organism is homo sapiens On the next filter, we add structure and 3D structure available. This filter will give protein results for which 3D structure is available. And next we are going to add, next filter we add the PDB, cross reference 3D structure database and PDB. And we no need to enter uh, any term here and we are going to hit search. We found all the human cyclooxygenase macromolecule with 3D structure available and their respective PDB IDs. If the PDB column is not visible, then add a new column. Okay, go to here, add or remove columns and add a new column. And scroll down, add the PDB column which is found under the databases section. Scroll up and click save changes. Now the PDB column is visible. For each macro molecule, the available PDB IDs are given along with their resolutions, chains, etc. Now the PDB ID with the best resolution value shall be selected. For prostaglandin synthase 2, we have this many PDB IDs available which have the respective resolution and the respective chains and the amino acid length also. For prostaglandin synthase 1, we have one PDB ID and prostaglandin synthase E, we have uh, many PDB IDs available. So we shall select the macromolecule which has very low resolution. This is an easy method to find the best resolution PDB ID for the particular enzyme. So that's all. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. If you find this information useful, please post in the comment section. Thank you all.